The folks at Hunky Dory worked with Practical Publishing to create this Hunky Dory card making collection. And this is issue number five. That means there's been more behind and more to come ahead. Uh, Anne Marie Catterall is um, really the person who coordinates all of their activities at Hunky Dory, and she is doing some of the projects in this kit. So let me show you what's inside. There's going to be a magazine, of course. There are 75 projects in it. I've tabbed some to show you, but let me show you what else is in this kit first. As you would expect, Hunky Dory is going to have their famous foiling and die cuts. In this kit, there are 54 foiled die cuts, and you can see they're all about um, going on adventure or just enjoying the out of doors. There's a beach scene, um, really beach, with whales and the penguins or pelicans, and you can see more of the seabirds there. Everything is foiled. Then there are four foiled adorable scorable sheets. So of course the artwork is matching what that uh, what those die cuts are. Nice to have the lighthouse, and there you've got that. And one more the foiling. Then we have four that are printed adorable scorable. They're printed on one side, and you know the adorable scorable is very heavyweight. I think it's 230 GSM. And so we're going to get four of those. Then we're going to get some double-sided papers. Now that's an unusual thing for Hunky Dory to have, but in this kit you can see that they are double-sided and there are four of them. All of these are the A4 size, so it's just um, right around eight and a half by 11, a little bit, little bit different. Then there are inserts. Now these inserts are a ghosted back image and Hunky Dory likes to have these for the inside of the cards. So there are a total of eight of these. Again, it's the same artwork, but it's very ghosted back and you can see how that would be pretty on the inside of a card, but I think in the magazine, they're going to show you some ways to use it on the front of your card. So there you go. If you were counting, that should be eight. So that's a really nice whole collection of all of those goodies. I'm sure you would agree, but I'm not done yet. So we'll tuck these aside. We're also going to get a cutting die. Now there are three hot air balloons and three clouds. So that's gonna be fun to see. And the hot air balloons are very lacy, very pretty. There's also some stamps. These are clear stamps, and there are 20 of them right here. You can see the flip-flops, the beach umbrella. We've got uh, sun, sea, and sand. We've got a starfish, all sorts of fun things. And we have a scene in this embossing folder. So there you go, all of that together. You've got kind of one of some of everything. And let me show you some ideas for how to use them. So as I open this, as always, you're going to see um, all of the contents that are in the kit. And I do appreciate that all of the instructions are there. Now, some are in centimeters, some are in inches, but you know it's really easy to Google and find out uh, which one you're maybe not familiar with. Look at this uh, stair step card, all with the stamps that you have, and just some fun things. There's party, uh, you're invited with the flip-flops. Let's go here. I thought this was absolutely fun to have. And you know about our um, push-up or our um, pull-up card. So that would pop-up box card. That's what it is, pop-up box card. So we've got the die-cut card all ready for you if you want to do something like that. Very fun to see them playing in the skies. And here is that ghosted um, insert as the background on our card front. So that works really nicely. And isn't that stunning? Using that cutting, that embossing folder, but then also doing the uh, hot air balloons on top, really nice. All over with the uh, flip flops and very fun to have those, um, all of those uh, chairs at the beach. And I thought this was really pretty to do the embossing folder with vellum. And you know we carry vellum, so that works for you. So just lots and lots and lots of ideas for um, summertime fun and just looking at this and you can see 
all of the wonderful things, including all of those foiled pieces. Hunky Dory has done it again in this wonderful kit, and I'm happy to say it's a Paper Wishes exclusive.